What is up guys? It is Musky and we're here with another episode of some crack pack. Alright, so if you remember from last episode, this is not how um, our little underground abode was looking. No, it was definitely not. It was all kind of not like this. So pretty much what I've done is make it look better. Um, what I have going here is I got some factory blocks, which fac factory factory. Okay, come on now, come on, factory block. All right, so you can craft them like this. You get uh, four iron, four stone, and you get thirty-two factory blocks, which is like ridiculous. It's pretty crazy. So yeah. Um, and these are all just variations with the chisel. So this is factory block. This this isn't. This is concrete, which I'll show you in just a second. This is actually cobblestone from the chisel mod. But yeah, it's all it's all similar. So what I've pretty much done is expand this out with a hammer that I got. So I got this hammer here. Um, yeah, I put the flux thing in there so I can charge it. So I can throw it like right into here. I will charge up. Can throw this into here. And then I also made a cutlass, which I can also throw in here. And the last thing I made is a. Ooh, this takes a long time to charge. All right, the last thing I made is a power fist. So this power fist um, has axe shovel. All this stuff in here, diamond drill. All right. So actually, this thing mines faster than my pickaxe. So if we can go and try this out, right over here. Here's that, that. So my pickaxe has silk touch on it though. It's charged. My power fist. But what I'm using for lighting here are these lux capacitors, capacitor. Yeah, capacitors. All right. So it's a modular thingy that goes on your power fist and then you can just right click boo, it shoots out these little things and then if you go into this tinker table here um, you can change the color so right now I have it set to yellow and it'll shoot out like yellow little things and I think the yellow the black and the gray look really good because the yellow and black are kind of like my accent colors from the more grayish tones in the, in the, um, the cobblestone and the concrete. So I got just like the factory box slabs so you can cut those in half as accents on the roofs with the lights coming down. I have a little window here that opens up to like this little dip down in the earth over here which is kinda cool. So yeah we have that going on. Come on. Alright, and then what else did I get? I got a some vehicle crafting. I got a, a modern weapon box so we can make guns, American weapons box, things like that. Um, pretty much what am I going to do here? I moved out some, well not really, but I moved out some machines. I made this crusher here so I can turn cobblestone into gravel and I can turn gravel into concrete. Because concrete is what I'm using for the ceiling here. Okay, this is very, very loud. Alright. So, these slabs here are actually carpenter's wedge slopes. So, if you look at... Well, okay. Carpenter's blocks. So, you can make these carpenter wedge slopes with carpenter's blocks and all this stuff. This is how you make it. A lot of wood and then it comes in like this kind of like bear thingy here carpenter's wedge slope like a little wood and then you can just right click the concrete onto it and it's got this nice little wedge so I like this it gives it some more detail and then I have it going up into the concrete with the thing and then this is our little flying up shaft up to the tree which is still there um, obviously all this stuff will be moved. I'm going to make a room for the smeltery somewhere and it will not be right sitting right here. All these chests, I have like so much stuff just and um, I got I actually made a gun here. 
I got the M9 Colt, which is awesome. I'll use this one mag. Sweet. Whoopsie. Yep, that is awesome. This is just the Carpenter Slopes 2 with the caution uh, blocks. I actually found this uh, cross memorial gravestone thingy. That's like a dog gravestone. And I found it like one of those dungeon things. Just put it there for now. I don't know. Maybe we'll put it somewhere. But yeah, this is looking nice. I'm going to make the, extend this hallway some down a little bit. Move all this stuff. Um, eventually make a room for the Tinker's Construct. Um, this is just a little hallway out to outside. Um, with the Carpenter's Block Wedges. And then I just have my power generation. Which is four wind turbines just for now so four wind turbines um, generating power to this uh, basic energy cube which is very very cool Jesus crusher is loud right. yeah when you shift click in it's a little bit broken right now but that's okay so yeah, today um, I kind of want to get into doing some Ars Magica. So Ars Magica here, I already started just a bit. Um, you can get this Arcane Compendium by putting a book in a um, item frame near those like light blue puddles of water that you can find. They're like little ponds of light blue water so you get some stuff in here dungeons exploring gaining skill points for spell components for spell all this good stuff right oculus we're gonna need a description table crafting altar so yeah i already got the oculus going here this is where you pretty much put your points into i've already done ours magica i did it in the last ftv pack which is very fun to do um, but yeah, I already put some pack, uh, some things in here. Since this is like a war server, we still haven't gotten into the war yet. But I want to do offense. Eventually I'll get it into defense and all that. But I want to do some offense. So I have some projectile, physical damage, and then magic damage. Yeah, I could have went to fire damage, but I'm going to go with the magic damage because I think it's cooler. So we need an inscription table, right? So we need a feather, spell parchment, okay, a torch. So that's not bad. Let's grab some wood here. Um, I'll just grab this. And then do I have a piece of paper somewhere? Hmm. Did have paper, right? Hmm. Where where did it go? Where did it go? Here it is. All right, piece of paper couple sticks look at that we have sticks and then a feather let's go check if we have a feather I'm not sure still my main storage is up here we're gonna have to move that we're gonna have to make it a storage room oh I forgot to show you something too all right feather 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 mm, feather sweet all right so we can just make this up here we're gonna need some slabs here go across like this um that is a thumb craft table oh, we need spell parchment first darn uh paper um this goes like this crafting yay fun right not really um this goes in the middle a torch all right, inscription table made. So let's go ahead and bring this guy down. I'm going to need a lot of paper, so I'm going to have to start up like a little paper farm or something. I don't know. All right, so here's our spell thing. We need... Um, um, okay, there's the search name uh, for spell... Hmm. Craft a writable book. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. Okay. Book. Book and quill. 
So we're gonna need feathers, books, shadow. Okay, so we're gonna need some more stuff to get started with this. Um, what happened to my sugar cane? All right, maybe maybe we don't. Maybe we don't get started with this today. Um, I should probably farm up some squid ink and some sugar cane before we get started with our magic cup. So that will happen eventually. Um, let's check out. Okay, six hearts of. Boom! One shot. It. All right. Let's pop back up here. Oh, also, I forgot to show you. Um, over here, I am making, starting a runway. So this will be a kind of a runway um, with the Flans mod. Uh, planes you can make planes with the flans mod which will be very fun this is gonna be a runway I will eventually have like a tunnel connecting to our main little place that we have going on now um, that will happen eventually I don't have enough resources to get the planes and all that yet because they are actually pretty expensive if I they use like guns and stuff and even the cheapest plane is like 90 iron or 60 iron um Something like that, yeah, and a bunch of wood, and, and a, like, this is a lot, a lot, a lot of iron. And then if you crash it, you need to replace things, and it's, it's a lot of resources. Oh my gosh, that was a lot of power. Shut up, dude. It's just annoying. Alright. So the thing that I forgot to show you is this little hole down here. Um, what I want to do with that is I actually want to have different levels of uh, um, levels in the base here. Um, yeah, I want to have the different levels. I want to have kind of different places to be because... Uh, it, this is going to be kind of like a bunker, right? It's like a war thing. We don't want to get hit by missiles and stuff. So we're going to have to have like a storage room. I don't think it's going to be on the top level. Um, maybe a better power generation room. Maybe we can get into big reactors, which is a cool mod. And yeah, that, sh that should be all well and fun. So let me go ahead and figure out what we are going to do next in this episode. And I will be right back. All right, guys, I am back, and I figured out what we're going to do for the next part of this episode. Oh, I already got my power glove out of there. All right, so I want to get into a little bit of blood magic. Now, blood magic is, of course, a more of a uh, magical mod. It's pretty, pretty crazy. Uh, it's a little expensive, so this is going to be kind of a long-term investment, I guess you could say. But you can do some very cool stuff with blood magic. But the first thing we're going to need is a blood altar, which is right here. So we got our blood altar. And we're also going to need, what is it here? Sacrificial knife. What's the other one? Um, looking, looking, looking. Um... Or of testing. Wait, what's it called? Probably lava crystal. It's called like an orb. Orb. Um. Weak blood orb. All right. I guess we can use the knife. I wanted to use the other one, but I guess we can use the knife. So we're gonna maybe a piece of gold, iron, and glass. So we need some gold iron and then do I have enough glass oh, no I don't do any sand in here oh I bet I can make sand sand crusher gravel and a crusher all right so I guess we're gonna make some sand here um, let me get this bit of sand going and then I will be right back Alrighty guys, so I am back and I got the sacrificial knife 
and then I have the blood altar. So eventually we're gonna make a room for this. Did I really say that? I don't know, but we are. Um, and yeah, so pretty much is what this knife does. Well, blood magic. If you've never seen it, it's a pretty crazy complicated mod, but it all revolves around you, um, or other things getting blood or life points or life LP, and then. It will, you can make certain things with it, and you can upgrade the blood altar and all this crazy stuff. So, if we right click here, it will take me my hearts away and it will give blood to the blood altar. Um, but what we need is this weak blood orb. Where is it? How do we make it? Weak blood orb is just a diamond. Oh, no, no. I want the division. Sigil, sigil of something. What is it now? Uh, water sigil, lava sigil, um, division sigil. Okay, so we're gonna need a weak blood orb, a blank slate, and some glass. So this weak blood orb, diamond, in there. Okay. So we're gonna need a diamond. Let's go. Grab that. Um, yeah, this is a pretty expensive mod. Um, I'm gonna have to get the quarry going again and all that good stuff, right? So let's throw that in there. It will start going with this. Throw some more blood in there just in case. Come on. Come on, baby. Alright, so we're gonna need. What is it? The vision sigil, some glass, this weak blood orb, which is like that. And the blank slate is just a piece of stone in there. A piece of stone. So do I have a piece of stone? Ready for the silk touch. Boom, piece of stone. Alright. Will this create? Um, I don't know. Uh, do I have enough glass, though? I think I made some extra glass. Alright, I got enough glass. That's always good. There we go. There's our weak blood orb. So, oops. if we click on our wiki, weak blood orb, it takes away the stuff from our uh, health again. And then it stores it in the, uh, like, kind of like a cloud. Like, the cloud of... LP, I guess. So we're also going to need a piece of stone. Throw that in there. Make sure we get enough blood. Look at all this blood all over the place. Blood. Blood. Oh, dang it. We're out of blood. So yeah, you can definitely kill yourself um, when doing this. Eventually, we're going to get the Dagger of Sacrifice, which needs a Tier 2 Altar and all this other crazy stuff. But the Tier 2 Altar can give us the Dagger of Sacrifice, which will sacrifice other animals instead of us. Is it just going to keep doing this, or is it hopefully like sucking it in there so it's making it so we have less? I don't know. I hope... It's sucking it up in there. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Because we definitely need the division sigil. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, you can kill yourself with this. Because if you click it when you have one heart left, then it will... Not be a good time. Oh, there we go. Okay, now it... Oh. But it had the particles. But it had the particles. Um. See, I don't know if it's just sucking it down. I'm just wasting it, though. Alright, so maybe let me... um uh f Go up to full health. 
and hopefully get some of this stuff. Hopefully we can get the division schedule done today. So I will be back when I have enough blood to do that. Alrighty guys, so I am back. Um, I have got the blank slate here, the weak blood orb, and we are going to go like this. We got the division sigil. Alright, so as you can see now, it says current essence is 1200 LP, tier is 1, and then the capacity is 10,000. And if we just click it, and here it says current essence 400 LP, and that's just kind of like the cloud. That's what we used our blood orb to get. So this is kind of crazy. Um, pretty crazy with this blood magic stuff. You can make some really, really cool things. Uh, it should be really, really fun to do. It's a little bit expensive, so it's probably not the best early game um, thing to be doing. But we'll get there eventually. We will work on it and we'll hopefully get better at blood magic. Um, also, we got to expand on the base and get storage running because our storage is so messed up right now. But it will be okay. We'll push through. We'll get through it. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, I will see you next episode. If you liked the episode, hit the like button, hit that subscribe button. Make sure that you see when the new videos of the series come out. And yeah, so I will see you next episode.